to expect yeah. in, a, in your post game back after some time off? What did your team show you tonight, especially in that third period? Yeah, I, I think a lot of good in, in some of the defensive parts of the game, but that game kind of was like really well played and then chance after chance, right? It got into some flurries at both ends. I'm not sure it was necessarily bad, but goaltenders. 3-2 probably should have been 7-6 on some of the chances, but both goalies made huge saves. So we'll take it, right? First game after Christmas, you never know what you get. They, they, they worked hard. They fought hard. Um, pretty close to where we want to be. What impressed you most about Servi's effort? Just the timing, right, that he can take three days off and come in and be that sharp. And that's true of their goaltenders. Well, I mean, two elite, elite veteran goaltenders that can know how to prepare themselves to play. And, when the guys in front of them had a breakdown, they both made a couple of just incredible saves in that game. And not like it was chances back and forth, up and down the ice, but the, 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 sometimes I think that makes it tougher for a goalie. But both those guys so dialed in. Sam Reinhart, two goals in this one, 21 goals now on the yeah. season. How would you best explain his production at his level? Just really smart. Like he gets his body into so many positions. So the, the goals are, are incredible, but the to keep the puck in the offensive zone at the end of the game just by how he positioned himself and, and knocked pucks down, that, that's the stuff that makes him gold. That line as a whole, what was working particularly well six combined points? Yeah, I think it was a big night by Sam. I, I think that Evans started to kind of raise his work level, and Sasha's pretty consistent with that. I think they could add a whole lot more, right? I think they had, they had some action there that didn't go for them. So I think Sam kind of is as elite as Sasha in some ways in terms of how he thinks the game, in terms of what Sasha does with his body. I mean, the added speed in both Barkov and Reinhardt's game, especially popped out tonight. Yeah, that's true, right? Like, like both of them, they're coming into their prime at their age now. They're, they're just starting to become physically mature, so they're, they're almost as strong as they're going to be, and now you can see they're as fast as they're going to be. And um, we add that to the experience of whatever it is, 800, whatever number of games they've got, an awful lot of games they've got under their belt, and now they can start putting those things together. This team is 3-2-2 two and two in their last seven trips to this arena. How much, have the, how much do you think the playoff series over the years and have prepared them to play in this barn? I think maybe more. I, we started to become a good team, I think, against Tampa last year. We weren't at the start. The first two games that we played against them, we did not play well. And then I think it was right around Christmas we came in and we came in shorthanded and played a heck of a game. And that was the start for us. So now we feel like um, some confidence. I mean, these are tight games, right? They're, it's one or two shooters. It's a post inside row. But I think we come in with the idea that we can play with them. I mean, over the last couple games, Kachuk's been a lot more active near the front of the net. Yeah. And he also had a pretty good defensive stick today. I mean, what have you seen from him? Um, the last couple of games. Yeah, I think that's his game. I, I would say that his game against uh, Vegas was one of his best of the year. He was just really dynamic. I, I won't value this game almost as much just because it's hard to come off three days. Um, he's been good defensively for us all year, but now he's looking like there's a little more action. I think Sam Bennett came off his injury, and I think it took him a little while to get back and going. So I think that line, it's not that they have a lot more to give. I think they're, they're going hard right now, but I think the good things will happen for them. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, guys.